Set his strings up in my head. As I got none. And I question myself again. What is it about me? What is it? What is it? What is it about me? What's happening, man? We're gonna do a. Uh, of course, I'm doing my video right now. As you can see, let's take a look at me. I'm gonna be giving a whole, let me see. A whole outfit type shit. Anyway, um, I'm not gonna do the long record. It's gonna be a recording, but it's not gonna be a long recording no more. Well, not no more, but you know, I'm gonna try to do it subjectly. You feel me? Try to break it down little by little. I usually like to do the long recording. Like, you know, just talking and the ideas come to my mind and I just, you know, just go through it with the emotions and everything else like that. No cause right now. Until I mention somebody's name and they all come out of nowhere like they've been hiding. But, yeah, until I go through it with the emotions and everything else like that, then I just spell out, you know what I mean, give it all I got, you know what I mean? Straight pill from the pill place. Stalking, man. Anyway, look at it from this point of view, man. Let me talk to y'all, man. Feel me? Let me talk to y'all, niggas. As soon as I reach this town that I'm in right now, where my job is at, um, all these garbage trucks that are coming out of nowhere, making noise. You know, I turn a corner, they want to turn a corner with me and shit like that. You know, I ain't bitching, I'm just saying. I'm just, you know, recording myself, basically. <laughs> so I'm just telling y'all what's really happening. So they're doing, they're doing all this antagonizing and agitating me and shit like that. So I'm like, you know what, I could do a topic about this, you feel me? They using, these are, when I say garbage truck, these people that work for, the sanitation office, right? Nah, they using picking up trash as a way of degrading me by saying that this is what I am. But yet, this this is what they do for a living, you feel me? So what are they saying about their own occupation that they do? You feel me? Like, if, if that's my... If, if that's your occupation, right? If that's your occupation, that's what you do, then why are you using us as a weapon to degrade me as a person? What does that say about you that you you, you have some insecure issues that you feel? Although you like your job and everything else like that, your feelings are more based on the opinion of what people think about what trash is. You understand? Because they say another man's trash is another man's treasury. So you have to change your opinion about it. It's not about the check that you're getting from the job itself. So he, they basically, what they're saying is that the check that I get compensate for the embarrassment that I'm at this job. And that's the wrong way to look at it. You feel me? If you at that job, then you need to take pride in it. You can say that this is not who I am right now, but that, it is where I'm at right now. But truth be told, it's where you at right now. So it is who you are in this moment in time. Feel me? Let's just call it for what it is. But they're using the thing that they do as a form of degrade. They degrade. They, they try to use it as me saying, implicating that this is who I am. But yet, this is what you work with. So, what does that? What are you saying about yourself? You feel me? So, I said, saw that in a split second, but it took me like four minutes to explain. But it happened in my mind in a split second. I seen it like a picture. It just takes it takes much longer for us to explain it. The word that came to my mind, because I'm a, you know I associate, I'm gonna associate. Although I saw a picture, and I saw what it says, and I, I read the picture has a thousand words, so I can I explained it as best as I can. I attach it to one word, alibi. Now, I know people are like, why would you attach that part to 
to uh, like alibi. So I'm like, you know what? Let me just look at the real definition of what an alibi is. A claim, a piece of evidence that one was elsewhere when an act, typically a a a, a crime, is alleged to have taken place. She has an alibi for the the whole of yesterday evening. That's just a sentence. Often, Often an excuse or defense for someone, especially by providing an account of their whereabouts at the time of an alleged act. You understand what I'm saying, man? You cannot use what you do or where you were, which is your alibi, you feel me, to degrade me, especially if that's what you do. This is all your, that you drive in the gutter. There's nothing wrong with driving. I wish I had a sanitation job. In New York City, where I came from, they had the great benefits and everything. You feel me? There's nothing wrong with it. There's nothing wrong with it. It's just the way you look at it. You degrading yourself by looking at it from that point of view. So I had to read what an alibi is. You feel me? Because this shit just popped up in me. Like, you feel me? It's not like I planned it the day before and everything else like that. No, this is just me right now because y'all bring it to yourself. So I got to spit. So an alibi... My job, I can use my job as an alibi. You feel me? I can use the person that I spend the night with as an alibi. I can use a club as an alibi. If the camera showed me that, then that's so whatever you surround yourself with or the moment that you are in right now, that is your alibi. Sounds it sounds biblical. Alibi. If it has an Ali. Alibi. You feel me? Sounds very powerful like your alibi should be your word it should be your balls you feel me <laughs> basically that's what it is my word is my bond is my alibi but yet you want to use the alibi the only thing that you really have you feel me in that moment in time of your your, your whereabouts you feel me your well-being to be great me what does that say about the individual I'm just saying, man. Somebody needs to explain that to me. Cause they, they, you can tell, like when you start thinking that deep into things and see people for what they are and what they do and the things that they use, you can tell that these people are embarrassed of the position that they're in. So when a person like me come along, it makes them feel as if, yo, I can express my frustration through this person, even with the tool that I have that supposedly belongs to me. Feel me? But I give y'all I give y'all like ten minutes of this. I got two more minutes. <laughs> Word right up. I got two more minutes. I ain't even got time to talk no Yeah I got two more well, I got one more minute now. So, they have alibis. You feel me? We need to. Like, we need to call them out for it. So it's an excuse used by a person <laughs> when they are trying to avoid getting into trouble. So they say they were somewhere else. They weren't. Well, we wouldn't say they weren't. But this is when you're being accused. When a person is charged with burglary, but they he says he was busy giving. A seminar during the time of the break-in, it is an example of an alibi. So I'm giving you another example of an alibi that people don't talk about. is the fact that people use their alibis as a form. It's actually quite the same thing. It's just that there's two kinds of alibis. The one that's telling the truth and the one that's using another alibi to lie for him. So they're using the alibi as the truck drivers was doing, as the, as the, uh, those sanitation drivers was doing, using that alibi as a form of a lie to implicate that this is what I am, but yet they're around that thing that they say that I am 24-7, which is the alibi when you look at the evidence of it. Stop playing with me, man. I'm going to come back into it. Re- name of this video is going to be called Alibi.